Hello friends, welcome back to the art room with Mr. Eck. In a previous lesson, we learned how to look at a picture and then try to recreate it with, as pencil art using basic shapes and doing some shading with a pencil. So we're going to bring those uh, skills back and we're going to do a realistic pencil drawing. And our theme is going to be rodeo, Texas, western, all those kind of things because our school is participating this year in the uh, district rodeo art show. So we want some really nice uh, realistic pencil drawings and um, I have a selection of um, farm type photos that I've taken and since I took them my students uh, according to the rules can try to replicate those as uh, closely as possible. So um, if you're in my class then you get to uh, choose from the photos that I've taken and just pick one that you want to spend a couple of classes uh, staring at and trying to recreate. I'm going to show you an example of how I would do that right now. So like with our shapes and shading uh, lesson that we had recently, uh, first thing I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to look, I've chosen a picture of a donkey that's kind of close up and I'm going to first sketch out some basic shapes to determine where it is uh, that this donkey is going to be on my page, where the horizon line is, all the, all the uh, basic things, I'm just blocking out the areas, and then I'll go back over it and um, put some more definitive lines, and once I get all my lines correct, then I'll start with the shading. And I'm going to do all this time lapse to save time. And here is my finished uh, realistic rodeo art example. A couple things to keep in mind. Um, number one, that there should be at least a little bit of gray almost everywhere on your artwork. Even if there's something that's light, it should have a little bit of gray. And then if you notice at the end, after I had smeared everything, I went back with my pencil eraser and I erased a few areas where I wanted the highlights to be, like the brightest areas specifically on the donkey because he's my main subject and I made those lighter by uh, erasing the pencil that I had smeared and that really uh, gives it a nice uh, contrast. Um, there should not be a whole lot of super dark areas. Um, most of your drawing should be a uh, mix of different grays. Only the very darkest areas in the picture you're copying should be the darkest areas on your drawing. Um, start lightly because you can always add more shading it's harder to take it away so shade a little bit and shade a little bit more and then shade a little bit more until it's the darkness that you want 
And besides that, uh, just take your time. Um, this is a project that takes time to do correctly and enjoy the process. Um, you know, art should be enjoyed while you're making it, not just after you're done. And uh, good luck and have fun. And I'll see you next time in the art room. <laughs>